Let's practice reading some SI calipers in this measurement chapter. So the first thing we need to do is to stare at the bottom zero. Do not get confused. Don't look up here. Look down here. Don't look at this line here. This causes confusion. Look at this line here. So we're really zeroing in on this reading here, which you can see is one, two units past. Uh, it's two teeth past. This is zero here. So this here is 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So this here must be 2. We're talking about 2 millimeters. So this reading here is 2 point something. Now we're not quite sure what this little tiny little distance between here and here is, but the fact that it's less than halfway towards the, th the third millimeter, it tells me that this is probably 2.2, 2.3, uh, near the beginning because this is clearly closer towards the number two millimeters as opposed to uh, the number three millimeters and we can find out by bonking our heads we go bonk and you can see that this line doesn't cut through bonk it's getting pretty darn close bonk now this one looks really good this one here looks like it's it's um, cutting right through and you can see that this line is uh, pretty good so I would say this is around three now when I bunk my head again, this is also pretty good, and this is getting worse and worse and worse and worse. So there's a pattern here. As you bunk your head, one, two, almost three, I think this is good enough. So I'll say this: the answer here is gonna be 2.3 millimeters. Because this three looks pretty good, and the four, if you wrote 2.4, I guess the answer wouldn't be wrong on the real provincial exam the choice A, B, C would be certainly more than 0.1, so you'd have to pick the best answer. But the nice pattern to see is that as you continue on, it gets worse, 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 and as you have the correct answer, and you go to the other side, to the left of it, it gets worse, 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 worse. So you can kind of approximate where, where the answer should be. So if you, if you chose 2.4, it's not the end of the world. The provincial exam choices will be far enough apart. Excellent, let's try another one. So here we're gonna look at the zero again. And we see that this is um, five, six. So this is a total of six millimeters and a little bit. This little bit we figure out by bonking our heads. You really shouldn't bonk your head on a real brick wall. It, it hurts. One, two, it's getting better. Three, getting better. Four, this looks pretty good. Five, it's getting worse. Six is getting worse. Seven is getting worse. So I'm gonna say 6.4 is the reading of this SI caliper. Let's try another one. All right, now we're on example number three. So we read the zero here. If you focus on this little point, what we have here is one, two, three, four. This here is four millimeters. And by the way, any object could be here. It could be a ball. It could be someone's uh, head. Um, and it's gonna be four point something. Now this middle point is slightly past halfway, so I'm anticipating the answer is gonna be, we're gonna start bonking our heads over here. So I'm gonna say bonk, bonk, and it looks like it's cutting through over here. It looks pretty good. Bonk it getting worse and worse and worse. So we're gonna say this is 4.5 millimeters. So you can see what I did here. This is four, and the zero is past halfway, so I immediately start looking halfway past. So I don't waste my time bonking my head here because it's not gonna work, I know for a fact, because this line is past halfway. So I start looking here, and we're not gonna choose 4.5, excuse me, but it's actually gonna be 4.7 because we're one, two past it, and this is where it lines up. So we'll say that this is 4.7 as the reading. So let's try one more SI caliper reading example. You look at the zero here. Now, did we actually successfully pass? So staring at this, finish line here, did we actually successfully pass any millimeters? And the answer is no, we didn't even pass one tooth. So immediately the, the answer is gonna be zero point something. So we can see that we're almost at one millimeters. So we're gonna definitely be, be past the halfway point. So I'm gonna start looking here. Boing, 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 getting better. Boing, this looks good enough. And of course, when we pass it, it's getting worse. So here I'm gonna say this is 0 0.9 millimeters. 
So for these SI caliper reading questions, the number one mistake is to accidentally look at the wrong zero or to look at this line here. But when in fact you need to stare at this zero here and count carefully count the number of teeth and consider how to get that one extra digit of accuracy, which is to uh, do this um, alignment uh, bouncing issue here. Great job. Keep it up.